and welcome to the ARC Automation Studio. I'm Alan Avery, a senior analyst here at ARC Advisory Group, and joining me here today in the studio is Mark Sengupta, a research director here at ARC, and he's just completed a study on SCADA systems for oil and gas. Thanks for joining us today, Mark. Uh, let's start off with uh, you're telling us exactly why you think you're qualified to, uh, you know, discuss the SCADA oil and gas market, uh, and, and maybe give us a feel for your uh, background in process automation. Yes, thanks for asking. I've been uh, working with the process in the process control industry since the late '80s as a project engineer, a sales engineer, and even a product manager before becoming a research analyst for ARC. I've had the opportunity to work with DCS, SCADA, and batch systems in several different industries, including the upstream and midstream oil and gas industries. I've even been through the offshore safety induction course in Aberdeen, and I can tell you that the Scottish definition of a heated pool isn't the same as mine. All this to say is I've lived it. Uh, but anyway, I've been researching the SCADA oil systems market for the past seven years as part of the ARC team. Uh, what are some of the underlying drivers that have been critical to growth in the SCADA oil and gas market? Well, for one, cybersecurity continues to be a hot topic uh, and attracts considerable industry attention after several high profile events. Uh, services addressing this issue will continue to grow and should outpace software and hardware sales, especially in more regula regulated industries such as pipelines. This is a pretty big issue for older systems as newer systems have better solutions to address cybersecurity. Newer solutions that leverage the flexibility of cloud will continue to grow, especially as continued uncertainty shrouds the industry. Producers will look to licensing models that can pivot at a moment's notice and are easy to scale and also allow secure data accessibility to a variety of data consumers, many of whom may not be part of the operator's organizations. Although already leveraging remote capabilities, the pandemic has also highlighted a greater need for more flexible remote access. <clears throat> you might say uh, this third bullet is a roll up of the previous two, but the aging of a significant portion of the install base, particularly in midstream, will provide project opportunities as well as support opportunities. Projects will come if the operator believes the risk of doing nothing outweighs the risk of a migration project. Uh, the loss of support for older operating system platforms will accentuate this risk for some. The expertise in understanding these older systems is also becoming scarcer among end users. And there should also be a significant amount of support services centered around maintaining these older systems. Alrighty then, uh, thanks Mark for joining us today and sharing your insight on the uh, SCADA systems for oil and gas market. Uh, audience members who'd like to get more information on this study uh, should be in touch with a client manager here at ARC uh, or the author himself uh, directly. Uh, that's all, all the time we have in the studio. Uh, thanks for your attention and have a great day.